fucking overwhelm just stopped there being an option to chump block it so i mean granted we could have uh i don't like this hand actually uh mark maker on three with nothing else going on is kind of meh we have i winner but no primal and then marsh dragon is not really something we want to play exactly on five we want to have a little more fodder for it so we're going to redraw this okay this is a little more serviceable we'll keep this we have all our colors now yeah that was a little unfortunate uh like i said there would have been an argument to take one hit there and i guess we would have survived a little bit longer but i mean we saw that last game where we took a couple of hits from that guy and then we just got so low so fast so uh let's see yeah i'm all right with that hey good one All right, Kaysalon, thank you so much for swinging by, buddy. I appreciate it. Hope you have a good night, friend. Get some sleep. And uh, like I said, man, if you uh, want me to do some testing with it, I'd be more than happy to. It would give me some good insight for me because I was trying to build an actual tabletop card game. But yeah, sleep well. Oh my gosh, my allergies. <laughs> Excuse me, guys. I might take a minute to go blow my nose and stuff after this game. I do apologize. There's an argument to potentially not play Shrine this early, but with a Marsh Dragon in hand, it might be worth it. Um, it's pretty lackluster, honestly. Hmm. I guess sacking it does make this a little bit bigger. I don't hate that particularly. It's not great, but it's not horrible either. I'm going to hold on this. <laughs> Thank you, Sandy. I appreciate that. Huh. It'll be interesting if we lose those guys because I personally think those guys are pretty medium. Okay. Get fire going. And then I think I'm okay killing that. I think that's fine. And then next turn we'll just sack the, the cultist to Marsh Dragon. It's a little unfortunate because we can't activate the sack twice. Oh, now we can. All right, cool. Yeah, I like this attack. Then we'll sack it to give that quick draw. You bet we... All right, I'm sorry to hear you're having frust you're having troubles with your phone, Cassidy. I hope it works out as well. I will look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Again, I'm really sorry. Uh, we could immortalize to do it all over again, but that seems kind of lackluster. Uh, we win this race, but not by much. So I think the fact that we have cut ties, we're gonna we're gonna hunker down a little bit here. They have a fast spell, so that's actually really good for us. I should have attacked, actually. But now, this is going to be really good. I guess... It's going to work out for us, because we're in a block. They're going to use their combat trick. Those war cries were a bit of a problem. I mean, we're fine. We can cut ties it, but... I would have really liked to get the trick out of their hand. Guess we just stopped them from getting another war cry trigger. Yeah, I think we just kill it now. I really wanted to get the two for one on their combat trick, but that's pretty dangerous. So we'll just hold here. We'll see if the trick can deal with our dragon or not. 
Ugh. That really needed to be charged, but that's okay. All right, so the trick that they have does not stop our Marsh Dragon. But it's not a Lightning Strike or a Biting Winds because it paused at the end of the turn. So it's not a Devour because they would have devoured their Sentry. What are we thinking? So it's got to be... Well, see, here's the thing. If it's a plus three, plus three pump spell, they could have attacked. So, I don't know. I had him on... Uh, I guess we could attack? No. I like the fact that it's holding back their guys. We'll attack with this and then get it back with Immortalize. That seems a little bit better. What? What? Huh. What spell could it be? Not devour. Hey, that's not horrible, actually. That's not horrible. Huh. Wish we had a little bit more fodder, though. Let's find out what it is. Interesting. Interesting. Uh, what do we need for that? Oh, well, luckily they don't have a way to pump it. Jade Horn. All right, that's not bad. It's a pretty good card for them. Flooding out is not the best for us, guys. Flooding out is not the best. So we can get back Cultist. I just don't feel like they're mortalized that strong. I'd rather mortalize something bigger. Hey, what's up, Chewbacca? It's going all right, man. It's going all right. Our drafts are... We, we've lost the same person actually twice, which is kind of funny. They're just taking it. Interesting. So their game plan is to play out that guy. We just need one more unit. I want to use the Immortalize on either a Marsh Dragon or our uh, Dancing Flame. We just need one more unit that we could sack. Preferably Mark Maker. Uh, it's a little rougher. That's a little rougher. All right, let's see if we see the fast spell now. They give that quick draw. <laughs> So our timing was a little poor on that because now actually sacking our uh, Marsh Dragon isn't the most appealing thing. Hmm. Can we kill them? They are at 13. They have a fast spell. They have four blockers we pump we get in with we get in with how many people we get in with let's see four blockers we get in with presumably a three one and this guy yeah i think it's worth doing sacking oh but we give them lifesteal though yeah, shoot. I think these three tacks are safe. I like these three attacks here because this... Yeah, so they have to double block. Oh, we'll see now what the pump spell is. This is a little dangerous. Yeah, that dark mask is pretty scary. It's a little unfortunate. <laughs> Kill this first. Maybe they didn't anticipate the quick draw. Even if they sack this to minus one our guys, we're still in pretty good shape. 
That worked out for us pretty. What is the fast spell they're sitting on? It's not an ensnare. They would have used it. And no, that's only attacking. Yeah, they probably just. They probably. Well, I understand. They probably. Uh, yep. Yeah, How many more turns do we have on this? I think it's four now, right? Yeah, it goes off next turn. Still nothing worth immortalizing. Hey. <laughs> so they have to block here? Can we kill them? We need another sack outlet. Like, if we really wanted to get greedy, really wanted to get greedy, we can immortalize our cultist to sack it? Does that win us the game? They block here. One, two, three, four. And then six still gets through. Yeah, you know what, guys? I think I'm just going to go for it. Oh, yeah, because this is also going to do three damage on the way in. That's super greedy, but I think we do it. Because they're going to be at... They're going to be at three. Yeah, I'm going to do it. Wait, what? No, no, what? Oh my god, you gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me right now. I thought I, I hit A space. I guess I did run out of time. That's so frustrating. I am I'm 90% positive. I mean, obviously I didn't hit it in time, man. That's frustrating. That is frustrating. How's work treating you, Chewbacca? We had the line. That was definitely the winning line. I don't think it was that late. How'd they get exalted? Oh, cause that, okay. Cause it, when it died. Okay, fair. Uh, well, oh, well, it's not quite, gosh darn it. It's so frustrating. Yeah, I decimated them mortalized. Gosh, well, I mean, I wasn't planning on them surviving. Uh, do we get any benefit from attacking here? I guess. No, wait a minute. That's not right. Even with quick draw, they put... Wait a minute. They put... Yeah, that's fine. Oh, man. I, I should have probably attacked here, too. Yeah, even if they put the fear tracker in front of it, we just quick draw everything else. Uh, how far away is it from its... Yeah, it's still not even close to its mastery yet. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I roped that time. Hey, we get to see what that fast spell is. Decimate. Wow, they held on to that decimate for dear life. Oh my god, is everyone running siege? Oh, wait. Oh, they got it off of the, 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 uh, our, uh, Kazuo. 
Kazuo. Yeah, we might lose this game now. That's pretty frustrating. Yeah, that's pretty frustrating. Not gonna lie. So now attacking here is not good anymore. <laughs> I think I have lifesteal. It does not. Oh, man. <laughs> Luckily, if we kill their, their guy, we get our Eye of Winter. I think it was supposed to go on the fear tracker. Huh. We talk about fear tracker, what happens? I guess we get to ping them. Yeah, that's actually actually good because then we oh we lost our shrine, never mind. Yeah, we might lose this game now. Gosh darn it. We can wipe their... We can kind of wipe their board. I think that might be better. Getting four things off... Three things off the board versus just the one. We get Eye of Winter though, but... We'll get it anyways. No, we can't. We can't do it. We're one shy. We can go here and here. All right, fine. We'll just get rid of this guy. How'd that guy get so big? Where'd he get the plus two plus two from? Oh, it hit double war cry? Wow, that was convenient. Uh, we can kill it. Oh, that's right. We don't have the thing anymore. All right, we'll just take it. Oh my gosh. So do they go for our fear tracker? Or do they go for our marsh dragon? Yeah, we might lose this game now. Yeah, they got stealing the Kazuo and then being able to get a decent invoke off of it. And then of course, it's crazy too because we had, it's just a little bit sour because of the fact that we had lethal. Oh no, we didn't, we didn't. We didn't have lethal. I take that back because they still had the play to um, they still had the play to draw strength their their flyer their healer their lifesteal unit so what'd they kill the mer dragon okay um we can stun their deadly unit and swing yeah, they, they did a really good job. Really good job. Let's see what they do here. I'm going to go for lethal here. I think it's worth it. Because we can pump our guys and yeah, our guys would die anyways. They would just trade. Yeah Let's see if we get them or not Yeah, all right cool we got there All right, whoo We salvaged that one <laughs>